Your XP walking brace includes an inflation tube and two cotton socks for enhanced comfort. Start by preparing the brace. First, unfasten the straps. Then remove the front panel and open the toe cover and foot flaps. First put on the sock. While seated, place your leg in the brace and position your heel on the back of it. Pull the liner up to remove any wrinkles. Next, wrap the foot flaps over your foot and the toe cover around your toes. Secure the front panel with the lower part inside the brace and the upper part outside the brace. Secure the straps from bottom to top. Tighten them so they are snug and comfortable. Since the XP walking brace air cells are initially deflated, you'll need to inflate them. Begin with the valve on the front panel. Firmly insert the inflate tip of the hand bulb into the valve. Cover the hand bulb pressure relief value with the finger of your other hand. Squeeze the hand bulb several times until the air cell is snug. Keep the hand bulb in the brace valve as you lift your finger from the pressure relief valve for 3 to 5 seconds. Then withdraw the hand bulb. For higher pressure, remove the bulb sooner. Next, move to the air cell on the inside of your leg and repeat the previous steps. Then move to the outside of your leg and finally to the air cell on the back of your leg. If you overinflate the air cells, simply deflate them by inserting the deflate tip of the hand bulb into the valve and squeezing until you've found a comfortable pressure. You can also adjust the pressure by tightening or loosening the straps. The brace is more comfortable when pressure is higher in the air cells on the inside and outside of the leg than the air cell on the back of the leg. Higher pressure provides more support for walking. Lower pressure is more comfortable when sitting or reclining.